Well, with a timeline erased with freaking Heat Ran, because apparently battling Heat Ran is what makes the league like as hard as it gets. We can just go do the league without uh without having done that. Oh, it was from here for like the autosave. Interesting. Interesting. So apparently you can also battle Lucas? Hold on. Hold on. Well, I was I was naturally went there to fly for a hot second. Force of habit. So we can battle Lucas apparently? Apparently? Let's have a look see here. Last time I talked to him, he just told me about his freaking kid sister or something. Hi? Hey, Harmonia, have I ever seen my kid sister? Guzma, was it you that was telling me that you could rematch? Or not rematch, that you could battle Lucas? How do you how do you do it? If so. Well, as I mentioned, many more Pokemon. I mean there are many more thrills for you to seek and enjoy. Wow. No, I don't want to use another repel. <laughs> Is there a way that you do it? Is it a thing? Oh my good gracious. Can you do it? I'm gonna freaking Google it. That's what I'm gonna do, see if it is a thing after all. Pokemon BDSP Lucas battle, I'll just say. Let's see here. I see the absolutely nothing point redeem in the chat there. The uh, oh, only the freaking best point redemption ever. How to battle versus Dawn or Lucas, so you can't. Players can battle against Professor Owen's lab assistant, Lucas or Dawn in BDSP. Players only have beat the main story first. Huh. Players can face off against Lucas or Dawn in a battle in Pokemon Brilliant, Diamond, Shining, Pearl. Depending on what gender the player chooses at the beginning, it will determine which character the player will face off against. Trainers who began, yada, 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 yada. Along the way, the players will battle alongside the lab assistants to defeat Team Galactic. I hate these articles that are so much longer than they need to be. I came for one bit of information. That's it. Um, for starters, players will need to have beaten the Elite Four and have become the champion of the Sinnoh region. After that, players can focus on completing their Sinnoh decks as they'll unlock the national decks, yada, yada. All this additional information. Players will start their post game back in their hometown from here, head directly to Sandrum Town. This is the location where Professor Rowan's lab is located, and where players can surf to find Romanus Park. That's the location that they will also only unlock when you reach post game. Let's see here. After clearing out the main story, Don slash Lucas will be outside of Professor Rowan's lab in Sandrum Town. Speaking with them will unlock the new Poke Swarm Pokemon feature. Did I do that? Did I unlock that earlier? I'm not uh, familiar. Have you seen my kid's sister? Did I ever unlock a swarm Pokemon feature? I don't remember. As they will push the player to where these swarms are happening. After this conversation, Don slash Lucas will mention that they will like to battle, but only on weekends. The, nothing of the sort has been mentioned. No, nothing of the sort has been mentioned. I think it's part of my freaking spear pillars being bugged out. It must be tied to the freaking spear pillar flag. I can't battle them. I don't know what to tell you. Like, I... Wait, I wouldn't even be able to change the, uh, switch time because the, uh... It locks you out of time-based events for 24 hours. But I don't even remember being shown Pokemon Swarms. I literally think it's tied to, a uh, Spear Pillar is what it is, most likely. Because the site said that they would mention that they can battle you, but only on weekends. Lucas has never mentioned anything of the sort to me. So, like... I... I don't know what to tell you. I don't think it's... I don't think it's possible. I don't think it's possible. I think it's because my game is bugged. From my bugged out spear pillar. Is what I think it is. So, uh... So there's that. So the same thing to you two. Oh. Well then. Well then. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Either way, we're not getting a... We're not getting that battle. Let's try the league once. <laughs> Let's try the freaking second league rematch for the, uh finale of this series maybe i don't know but yeah i gotta go get ready for bed thanks for the entertainment bye everyone have a great stream i appreciate your sub by hanging out happily ever game i hope you have an awesome rest of the night and take care have dreams of this glitchy game i guess or something no i don't know um <laughs> but yeah, after you're done with the game you should pick up pokemon brilliant diamond wait pick up the pokemon brilliant diamond game and save one of cyrus's limes and throw the game <laughs> i would if i wouldn't be lending this to like family members at some point after what, are, what even are Cyrus's lines anymore? I don't even remember. So, apparently they have their platinum teams when you rematch them. I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see if this is the case here. Challenge by Elite Four, Aaron. What are you gonna have? Yeah, Mega. Okay, yeah. I guess they do. I guess they do then, huh? Well, sure. Let's, um... Maybe this can... Our rematch here can just be, like, the, uh, the finale of this series. And then I'm never coming back to this game again. Um... Oh yeah, look at that. 
Look at that level increase there. Well, thank goodness you're detecting here. Thank goodness for that. Are we gonna go through the ceiling like we did in the initial freaking thing where Bob? Speed boost. Gonna be real fast and stuff. You got it twice in a row? Are you kidding me? Wow. Oh, I, I just realized, you know what actually is different to this compared to the first time we did this? We can actually listen to the right to the game OST this time. Oh my good gracious. We had the pre day one patch version before. This time we get to listen to the actual the actual sound check. Of course you did. Um. Um. This is um not very good. Okay, thank goodness you didn't use the tech there. And we are still going through the ceiling. That hasn't changed. Gosh diggity darn it. Gosh diggity darn it. Yeah, I don't know if I want to take the time to like search for an area. especially after how long it took in uh, how long it took in Platinum, you know. Um, I admit that you have pushed me to this extreme. I can say that at the end of this playthrough. I don't know if I'm going to throw the cartridge though, per se. I'm just going to freaking uh, retry this because... Probably could have one shot with that initial fly if it wasn't for you raising your stats and stuff. But at least get one in Explorers of Sky and Area Dose? We could, potentially. We shall see. We shall see. Yeah, I'm starting to really feel the, uh, you know, competitive items, beneficial natures, competitive movesets, EVs and IVs that these, that these Pokemon have. I've heard that apparently Eevees and Ivies have been done away with in Legends from what I've heard about some of the leaks. As one of the, uh, as one of the things that I heard tell of. Something that reached my eardrums. Interestingly enough, so. That might well, might well be the case there. I also might instead just, like, do this. That's what I might do if it's the Omega, because that's bug and flying, right? Is the thing. Hi, I'm Aaron. You all right then? Time to battle. Well, here we go. I used the. F oh yeah. Oh yeah. You did redeem the freaking name of Pokemon, but you redeemed it at a. Uh, you also. It's also worth mentioning that you redeemed it at a point where uh, you know I hadn't actually caught a Pokemon, and that's that's intended for that point. Redemption is intended for. Uh, you know, after I've caught a Pokemon, naming it from there. Not redeeming it to, you know, get me to go specifically seek out a Pokemon just to name it. I mean, I can see maybe. I don't, I don't know if it'd be like a common spawn. I can try very briefly. Also, am I losing my mind? Or the first time that I faced Aaron in this rematch, he had, uh, like, the timeline that I just erased. He had six Pokeballs, but this time he had five. Like, he should have had... Like, he should have five both times. He probably did have five the first time, and I just didn't notice it. But for whatever reason, my memory is telling me that he had, a uh, That he had freaking six Pokeballs. Like, the first time before he reset the timeline. Now it's five. I don't know if I'm losing my mind. I might be losing my mind. But... <laughs> but there's that. Well, yeah, so, um... So it seems like the Elite Four would actually just straight up be higher level than me now. Is kind of the thing. But we should be able to manage, maybe? Should be able to- Hey, some level ups and stuff that I don't care too much about. Um, Vespaquen, you are freaking dangerous. I'm just gonna take you out as fast as I can with Brave Bird is what I'm gonna do. Is what I'm gonna do. I've actually been looking into, like, builds for- for Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky. I've heard that Vespaquen is apparently like the one Pokemon that gets a room hitting move that's a physical move with the uh, attack order or whatever the heck it is, which is pretty interesting. Which is pretty interesting thing about Vespaquen from, uh, from Explorers of Sky. Yeah, I'm just taking you out like that is what I'm doing. Not taking any risk here, I don't think. Be gone. Be gone with you. Neat. Well, guess my ace is level 70 now. It would seem, would seem, a little smidge with the leftovers I took from that one Munchlax. I'm gonna send out Skizzer. <laughs> what a, what a way to butcher that name. 
What a way for that. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this in that case. If you're gonna go ahead and send out your scissor. I'm like, I'm just gonna go ahead and flamethrower you is what I'm going to do. Oh, oh, okay. Well, which is it gonna do? Gosh darn you. Gosh darn you, of course you'd have that berry. Hey, look, we got the burn. What is that, a 30%? Alka berry was used up. Sword dance. Oh, thank goodness you're using that this turn because you won't have another turn to actually, you know, use an attack. Unless you have, like, an attack that moves first or something. But if you do, it would probably be physical. And now you've been burnt. Yeah, you're, uh, you're just screwed here. You're just screwed here. There we go. Neat. Well. Neat, neat. See you later, skizzer. <laughs> See you later, nerd. Let's send out Drapion. As some people say it. Earthquake should be super effective against Drapion, I believe, right? I believe? Probably? My memory kind of tells me that it might not be. Oh, yeah, we'll keep struggling till the very end. Oh, is that so? Is that so? Oh, look at them stars and stuff. Wow, you're so fab. You're so fabulous. Oh, crud. Well, you're faster than I am, I guess, which I guess isn't too surprising considering the EVs and IVs and stuff. Yeah, see you later, drapes. <laughs> see you later. Didn't we get, like, the two Scorpies and Explorers of Sky that we named, like, Paul and Pauline or something? There we go, first one down. There's still one step behind. You've won. Wow.